welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a review on this brush holder. So for this video, I collaborated with a brand called the Cosmetic Archive. Just a little background info for you guys. So I found them through Etsy and I was actually looking for drawer organizers for my vanity. And the first thing that popped up was this compact organizer that I just fell in love with. It was so pretty. It was actually custom built to fit into the Alex drawers from Ikea, which I have. So I thought that was super cool and so I ordered it. And I also ordered another organizer that was, it was like um, a six section like square organizer. I'll insert a picture so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So within minutes of me ordering this, I got a message from Ian who is the owner of this brand and he basically was just thanking me for my business and my support and to letting me know that he was going to be building my organizer tonight and then I'll ship out the next morning. I got that message. I was just so happy for how much they appreciated my business and actually took the time out of their day to contact me and tell me thank you. I also loved how everything was handmade. I didn't know that. I didn't know that's how Etsy worked, that it was all like handmade stuff. So I just gained a ton of respect from them. And I also loved that they were stationed in Rochester, Minnesota, which is like an hour away from my house. So I also thought that was super cool. So then about a week later, I placed another order and I got the same two things because I wanted to start filling up my drawers and because I just love them so much and then a couple weeks passed I actually stumbled across my YouTube channel and then they contacted me and asked me if I wanted to collaborate so I paid for everything on my own except for this brush organizer this one was sent to me for free to do a review on it for you guys without a doubt in my mind I wanted to do that because I thought so highly of their company and I just really appreciated what they were doing so I really wanted to try and get their name out there and tell more people about them. So I didn't even think twice about collaborating with them. So I'm just going to talk a little bit about this brush holder. I'm going to lift it up one more time. It's super heavy, so it's really hard for me to lift up, especially with all my brushes in it. So as you can see, this thing is huge, and it's just super heavy duty, just very well made. And it's made with wood, poplar, and acrylic. So the acrylic is this see-through part on the front that kind of looks like glass, and that just gives it such... A nice like chic classy look I just absolutely love it so it has a two 13 and 3 4 inch sections and that's held in by the acrylic part and I especially love how it's white because I kind of have like a white theme going on in my beauty room so I just think it looks so pretty in there and then I also love how you can put your own stuff like inside of it to custom make it kind of so these are just um, like vase fillers and it's actually my second time changing it before it was blue and they were like little itty bitty um, crystal like things that I got from Ikea but I wanted to change it up a little bit so I put purple and clear in here and I think I like this a little bit better because it's they're bigger and I feel like you can just see more of them so I absolutely love how you can custom make anything so if you get sick of the color that's in there you can change it to like blue purple silver clear like anything you want to really like match your beauty room or like the color scheme that you have going on. And then as you can see, I have a ton of brushes and I'm still not even filling up half of the brush holder. There's actually a lot of space like in between the sides of it. But if I push them all like to one side, it'd probably only be filling up like half of it. So it can hold a ton more brushes. And then also if you don't have that many, because I know a lot of people don't have that many brushes, it still looks really pretty with like just a few brushes in here. I really do think this would be perfect for anyone no matter how many brushes you have. The one thing that I was worried about with this is that my brushes are always dirty and I'm sure everybody else's are too and this is white so I was kind of worried about it getting dirty. I've had this for like three weeks now and I only got one little mark on it. It was from my foundation brush and I didn't know this but the finish of it is actually washable so if you do get it dirty, it's very easy to clean. I honestly just took some water on a rag and I wiped it down and it came right off. You don't have to worry about getting this dirty or anything like that because it does come off really easily and it's okay to wash. Cost of this was $69.99 and I actually do think that's a very good price point for this because it is handmade and it's so heavy duty and sturdy and just a really really well made product so I really do think that it's worth the, pr worth the price. You only have to buy it once. So my drawer dividers were I think like $40, 30 to $30 or $40 I want to say and I have no problem paying for that because it, you only have to buy it one time. It's not like it's makeup where you're buying a $40 foundation like every month or two. It's something that you only buy one time. That's why I just don't really have a problem with it and I'd rather have my makeup organized and look pretty. Like every single person that walks in my room looks straight at this and asks me where I got it because it's just so pretty and it adds so much character to the room. So they were awesome enough to give me a discount code which is Jazzy, just J-A-Z-Z-I and you can use that at checkout for 10% off of your entire order. You obviously don't have to use that. I'm just throwing it out there because it is a little bit pricey and you do save a lot of money with 10%. 
So I'm very thankful they gave me that discount code for you guys. I think that's all I have to say about this. There's not much more that I can talk about other than the fact that I just love the way it looks. I love the way it holds my brushes. I love everything about it. And I especially love the owners of this company. They're just so sweet and they really do deserve all the business that they do get. That's why I really just wanted to tell you guys about this. And honestly, if you have the Alex drawers from Ikea like I do, which I know a ton of people have them, everything that they sell is custom made for those drawers. And they have like a couple other things that don't go in the drawers, but everything they sell is custom made for that. And it all kind of goes with the same like white theme. So I just absolutely love that. I'm gonna leave their website or link to them on Etsy for you guys down below so you guys can find them super easily but again it's just the cosmetic archive if you search that on Etsy it'll pop right up so thank you guys for watching this video and if you have any questions about it please comment down below and ask me anything you want and you can also ask them they have a little messaging thing on Etsy for you so if you have any questions just let me know thank you guys for watching this video and supporting my channel and everything that you guys do for me I really really appreciate it and let me know if you buy anything from them or if you already have bought something from them let me know how you like it because i just love hearing you guys' feedback thank you guys for watching again and i'll see you guys in my next video